Hi, I'm Jim Mathers, and I'm talking about the 24 characteristics of a genius. You can learn to be a genius. It is possible. If you take these 24 steps and practice one per day, and then rotate through, and then bring others into it, talk to them about it. How can you make this work? Well, this one right here, perception. Hmm. A genius is always thinking. He's always has his mental radar working 100% of the time. He's open to other people's ideas. When your assistant walks in the door and she looks like she's troubled and you ignore it, you're ignoring your perception. If you order her to go get something done and you just perceived that she's really upset about something and you ignore it, whoa, you're gonna have a problem later. It's better to observe it. Now maybe at that moment there's an emergency. You see she's really upset and you ignore it or you note it. Say, wow, she's upset. Good, you perceived it. I don't have time to handle this right now. I need this done. You say, go get this done, and when you're done, come back and talk to me. So she handles the emergency. She comes back and you say, what's going on? She's like, nothing, nothing, nothing. You say, look, I can see. I know. I perceive. There's something going on. Just tell me what it is, and if I can help, I will. Now, it may be a personal problem, but the moment she communicates to you what the problem is, even though you can do nothing about it except acknowledge her, you'll make the problem in her universe better. Also, she'll perceive you as a great leader, as a genius. So trust your perceptions. Care more about other people's needs and wants than your own. True geniuses don't worry about themselves. They worry about everybody else. And I don't mean worry in a bad sense. I mean they perceive other people. They perceive what people are wearing. Do you notice, if you, if you notice this, if you walk into your office, and you notice one of your employees has a new hairdo and you ignore it. That ignoring is actually like a physical blow sometimes, especially if they see that you noticed. So if you notice, you say, wow, great hairdo, Sally. You would increase the genius factor of your employees just by that act, just by seeing, perceiving, and communicating your thought. So take heed of what you see. Look, observe, perceive, trust your mental radar. If you know there's something wrong in the office, don't ignore it, go out and look. Add to your perceptions. The more perceptive you are, the more genius you are. Have a great day.